Hey, Midtown Church, this is Pastor Ephraim, and I've got a little bit of a word for you. Easter is just around the corner. Can you believe it? And as we think about the resurrection of Jesus, I want to share this word from the Gospel of Mark, chapter 16, verse 1. It says, when the Sabbath was over, Mary Magdalene, Mary the mother of James, and Salome brought spices so they might go to anoint Jesus' body. Very early on the first day of the week, just after sunrise, they were on their way to the tomb and they asked each other, who will roll the stone away from the entrance of the tomb? But when they looked up, they saw that the stone, which was very large, had been rolled away. As they entered the tomb, they saw a young man dressed in a white robe sitting on the right side, and they were alarmed. Don't be alarmed, he said. You are looking for Jesus the Nazarene who was crucified. He has risen. The stone was rolled away. As we think about the resurrection of Jesus Christ, as we prepare for Easter, I want us to think about the things that might be blocking our view from knowing the truth of God, the love of God, the grace of God, the, the freedom found in God, our purpose that is found in God by truly knowing Jesus Christ. Sometimes religion, sometimes tradition, sometimes lies and myths, things that we believe that aren't helpful for us, they are like the stone in the way of knowing that Jesus rose, knowing how much God loves us, knowing that God has a purpose for us, knowing that God has healing for us. What is the stone that might be blocking you from seeing the truth? Is it pride? Is it stubbornness? Is it unforgiveness? Is it arrogance? Is it low self-esteem? I want you to know that whatever is trying to block you from seeing the truth of who God is for you, the stone has been rolled away. Ah, that's a great way to prepare for Easter. God bless.